Hey everybody and welcome back to another video. This is a video that's going to be unique for me on this channel as I don't open up a lot of football cards. I did happen to randomly open up some of these score fat packs maybe a week or so back. Um, but I am doing this to participate in the fantasy football draft contest that Vince over at the sports card ripping teacher is uh, putting out. So thank you, Vince, for the challenge of getting into this. I had to get out to my uh, local LCS. Um, I guess if I just say LCS, I don't need to say local LCS. That's kind of a, um, I guess I'm being repetitive there. I'm babbling. Um, but I went to the LCS, had to get some supplies, and I uh, saw the football blasters, and I said, let me get one of these, and I will participate. So I have seen some videos and uh, seen who some of the other participants have selected. I know uh, my um, competitors in my home run challenge, Justin from Three Good Nerds and Brad from Doogie's Dugouts are participating and it looks like there's gonna be a bunch of other people as well. So excited to be a part of this and excited to, uh, to get into this. So I'm going to uh, start to open this up again. I don't, I don't, I've chosen to not open football. I am, football is probably my most favorite sport. I'm a huge football fan, but growing up, I always collected baseball cards. And when I got back into the hobby um, in COVID, I only started back with baseball cards. And I've kind of made the decision that I, I don't want to get into football because, man, then you just, just get down a rabbit hole. Um, but... I'm going to jump in with this. I, I bought a few packs of these. I found some decent cards, a numbered card. Um, curious to see what comes out of this in the blasters. So um, we are looking for those ultra rare top 100s. Um, I don't know what the odds are of pulling one, but the the uh, top 100, I think those are the best cards to get. There is a chance of autographs, although um, I think it's very small out of a blaster box, but um, we'll see. So I'm looking here, I have to, as part of this contest, you gotta pick up either a blaster box or a couple of hanger boxes or maybe four fat packs, just trying to get to that um, level, I guess, uh, buy-in, so to speak, that Vince was looking for. And you're gonna be selecting, I'm gonna be selecting one quarterback, one running back, one ride receiver, and then a flex that can be either a wide receiver running back or a tight end. Um, and basically the way it works is you only get a point for every touchdown that they do. So if they run or pass or receive, that's one touchdown, one point. That's pretty much how it works. So we're looking for the superstars here for our contest. And we're looking for the rookies for um, our collection so i don't think i saw anything in there trey lance on the yellow poor trey he's now i think he's down with justin's boys we've got a sack attack we've got a potential on michael meyer daniel hunter and that's it so really a dud of that first pack Let's see what we can get in here in pack number two. Thank you for stopping by. If you're new to the channel, please hit us up with a uh, subscription. Hit us up with a like. Michael Vick. Jeez. I guess he's redeemed if they're still making baseball cards for him. So Daniel Jones is a possible. Ramondre Stevenson is a possible. Although Zeke Elliott will be bogarting touchdowns from him. Not much going on in the second pack as well. We've got a Will Anderson rookie and a sack attack and Ladanian, Ladanian Tomlinson on the first ballot Hall of Famer. So two packs and really nothing. I'm just going to go back through this because I went through it super quickly, but I don't think I saw anybody in there. Well, Jalen Waddell, maybe. Um, I'll put him down there for a consideration I guess but if I have to pick Jalen Waddle I'm hurting that's not gonna hold up um, I did see Brad took J 
Jalen Hurts, which is a great pick. Um, so we'll we'll see what we can find in here. Again, looks like we've got nothing really from a um, Justin Jefferson. There we go. There's a, a good one to get. Miles Garrett. Hendon Hooker. There you go. Henry Tuo Auto Auto. Roshan Johnson. We've got a celebration. That's a George Kittle. He's a possibility. We've got a huddle up on the Bears. We've got a Ryan McNeese, Ryan Brissy, and a BJ Olajari on the rookie card there. So, so far, not a lot to write home about. Let's get into the second half and let's hope that we pull some fire here and at least. If for nothing else for the contest, we get some nice cards because right now we are not doing well. Justin Fields, he might be a potential. Stafford, Brock Purdy, Justin Tucker, Lane Johnson, Barkley. We've got a huddle up on the Pats. That's nothing. Kayshawn, what is this? Jalen Waddle and a celebration of Travis Kelsey, which may have been a card to pick prior to um, him blowing out. I don't think he blew out his knee, but I think it's air quotes hyper extended. So let's see what we can find here. Two packs left. I haven't really found a killer quarterback yet. Looking for this is a so this checklist by the way is four hundred deep, three hundred with uh, base vets and then one hundred with another one hundred with the rookies. So um, you know not going to get everybody out of a blaster. Broderick Jones, we've got look some kind of numbered card here. Dak Prescott numbered to five sixty five. So that is a nice one there. Get that sleeved up. That's an option also for our contest here. Numbered to 565 is not a not a low num low numbered card, but we will take it. Tanner McGee. Nothing else there. So we are down to our last pack, folks. Um gonna need some last pack magic here because i was hoping to get this guy josh allen or jalen hurts um haven't gotten either of them darnold no let's see here trey lance no mccaffrey's a po definite possibility michael carter no nolan smith this guy's going to be good. Just don't know when. We've got something weird here. Not sure what that is. Jair Alexander. I'm going to save that because I don't know what that is. I don't think it's numbered, but it's a definitely some type of an insert. Ezekiel Elliott. And Huddle Up with Tua. So that's a bummer that I am not going to have a tier one quarterback. So this is Zay Flowers. This is Zay Flowers on, I'm not sure what insert this is. It's an alien insert maybe. Um, there is kind of a little scratch going across. I don't know if you guys can see that right through his helmet. Literally eye level. It goes right across. I don't know if I can get that so you guys can see that, but a little bit of a scratch there. That might, it might buff out. I'm not sure. Um, nice looking card. I, I'm high on this guy long term. I just don't know where he would be for this contest. So let's see what we've got here, folks. We are, we are not looking good. Um, not looking good for our options. All right. 
those away. I'm going to take one more run through this just because I don't like my cards. Mark Andrews is a stud. But again, you only get points for touchdowns, and he doesn't get a touchdown every day. So you've really got to hit on the quarterback. Um, which is why I was hoping for like a Jalen Hurts or Allen. Um, so for my quarterback, I am going to go with... No, I'm not going to go with Brock Jones. I don't even know if he's healthy. And I just don't trust. Sorry, Vince. Um, I just don't trust your boy Fields. So for the first four weeks, ugh, God. I kind of hate both these guys. Um, I will go with Dak for my quarterback. Um, even though I think Jones will have a lot of rushing yards as a quarterback. I don't know how many touchdowns he'll get rushing. For my running back, I'm going to go with... Well, I think Zeke Elliott is going to Bogart touchdowns from um, Stevenson. And I think Debo Samuel is going to Bogart touchdowns from McCaffrey. So I'm going to go with Saquon as my running back. I'm going to take Justin Jefferson for sure. And now I need a flex. And I guess I'm going to come back with um, McCaffrey as my flex. So my team is going to be Dak. Saquon, Christian McCaffrey, and Justin Jefferson. That's going to be my four. I'm not thrilled about it. I think it definitely could have been better. I'm a little, I think everybody's going to have Justin Jefferson probably. And I know I saw Vince, I think, had McCaffrey. Uh, these two are going to be suspect for me. So that is it. So um, thank you to Vince for uh, extending the invitation. Um, you know, I'm happy for more people to d try and jump in. So um, as far as this blaster and my review of this blaster, uh, you know, I'm glad I don't collect football. This, I ended up, I probably overpaid for this. I paid $35 for this blaster, which I just wanted to kind of support my LCS and get into this contest way more than I really wanted to spend, but I just wanted to buy one. Um, yeah, I mean, I don't know how much this Zach's going for and I don't know how much that is. But other than that, I, I, I'll go through it again. Again, I don't know the box, so you'll have to let me know. Um, didn't seem like I got my value. Didn't seem like I got even 10 bucks back. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, so I'm uh, editing this in. I told you all that I was kind of a newbie with regards to football. And uh, I knew this was a unique card just because it looked unique. Uh, a little bit of research after I completed my video, and it turns out this is a super short print case hit. It's called an extraterrestrial, which makes sense because there's little green alien heads on there. And uh, this particular card had a last sold yesterday of 50 bucks, 49.99. So um, I stand corrected when I say uh, I didn't get my money's worth. The last three sales on this card were 41, 44, and 49 for Mr. Zay Flowers from Boston College, wide receiver rookie for the Baltimore Ravens. So I just wanted to dub that in and uh, let you all know. Thanks. Everybody, thank you for stopping by. Please hit us up with a like and a subscribe. Uh, feel free to jump into this contest, and we will see you all for the next video. Bye, everyone.